If you're having issues with your Enphase system, here's a 60 second fix. Behind me is an Enphase system. It might not look exactly like your system, but the steps to reset it will be very similar. Overall, the solar on the roof is powering through this combiner box here. It is connected to an AC disconnect where all solar will have. In this instance, there's an inverter for the batteries and two batteries, but ultimately, all that solar energy will then pipe into and power up your electrical panel over here. And when you are resetting your panel, the most important thing to remember is that you want to start turning things off from the solar side first. And so things that are closest to the solar is what you're gonna start resetting. In this combiner box first, you'll be wanting to turn off all the breakers. So reset your breakers. And then turning off this AC disconnect, then move the handle from the on to off switch. And then finally, you will turn off your solar PV breaker. So moving this from on to off. So you're gonna wanna wait a minute for the power to dissipate, and then you're gonna start to turn things back on in the reverse manner. And so from your electrical panel first, and then to the solar at the very end. And so we're gonna switch this breaker back on. Then we're gonna move over to the combiner box. Uh, first locate the AC disconnect. Make sure that one is now switched back from the off to the on. And start switching back on the solar breakers in the combiner box as well. After you do your reset, you're gonna notice that you're gonna have a few sets of red blinking lights. That means that when it's flashing red, your IQ, this combiner box is resetting. And so you're gonna have to give it a minute and hopefully there is sunlight available. But when you are finally up and running, you're gonna notice three green lights. The one on the very far left, that's to make sure that your system is connected to Wi-Fi. And the two most important lights that you wanna see are between these two buttons. So the one on the left with the lightning symbol is your power production LED. And this, when it's working, will be a green light and it indicates that all your microinverters are producing power. On the one next to it, it's the device communication LED. And when it's green, it's showing that all of your microinverters are talking to this combiner box here. Great, we now notice that the first green light is up and that means that the system is connected to Wi-Fi. And that's this far left one here with a cloud and an arrow on top. The Enlightened Communication LED. And it's to show that your system is connected to Enphase, Enphase's cloud. Don't be alarmed if these two lights in between take a little bit of time in order to boot up, especially if on a cloudy day, it needs enough time for the panels to generate electricity so that it actually starts to speak properly. And so we now notice that one of the lights are on, and the second light should be on shortly as well. Give yourself a few minutes to give the system enough time to properly reset. But after that, I hope that this saves you a service call and gives you a good guide into how to properly reset your system. And if this was helpful, make sure to like and subscribe for more tips like this. And if you have any questions about your system particularly, drop it down in your comments and we'd be happy to help. So if you are in Southern California and you're looking for solar or battery, hit the link below and we'll be in touch.